Hello everyone. I wanted to do a quick video review on this soprano sax that I've had maybe a year, year and a half or something. I told y'all I've been doing reviews on things that I've had for a while and um, you know, it's just saxophone related. So uh, let's talk about it. Anyway, this is the Chateau and I, I think this is the pro level soprano saxophone that they offer. And it says it's the VCH S8201. And I'm not going to get the number behind that. I don't know if that's just a serial number. But it, it's, it's pretty. It has a lot of those engravings on the side. And I'll do a quicker, a closer look and all that. Um, it looks like it's pretty decently built. It kind of looks and feels more like it's probably an intermediate saxophone, even though they call it pro. Um, it comes with two necks. And from what I was told at Music Medic in Wilmington, where they overhaul a lot of saxophone stuff, and they, they actually sell this. You, matter of fact, I think it's musicmedic.com. You can actually see it a little closer. Anyway, they said that this was supposed to be made after the Selmer Super Action 80 Series 2 Soprano. So I heard that, and for the price brand new, they said this thing would be about $1,600 back then. Um, and so I was kind of working my way towards getting it. Well, what happened for me is I ended up buying it off of somebody who looked out for me and gave me a, a super deal for it because they were um, endorsed. Matter of fact, music by Pedro. Uh, Pedro, is, you definitely check out his channel. Very good saxophonist producer. He's the man. Um, does a lot of reviews as well. Anyway, um, so he let me get this for a stupid, ridiculous price. I sold my old soprano and I got it. Um, one thing I will say is that he did. He had some something done to it. The soprano didn't sound quite like the soprano that I heard, but he did some things to it to make it be quiet because he don't like hear clanking keys. So I don't know if it took away some of its sound or whatever, but it still sounds pretty good. It's one of the best soprano saxes I've had at this time. A lot of people don't know anything about Chateau, so I figured I would talk about Chateau so that you can kind of get an idea about it. Um, so I have a new mouthpiece. I'm still getting used to playing this thing. But anyway, um, I will now give you a closer look at how it looks when it comes in the case and things so like that. this is what it looks like in the case beautiful case beautiful case beautiful case and like i said this is a little bit older so i have a little bit of dings on my case but it's very very nice it looks so nice sitting in here it makes you not even want to play it and it allows you which i like to keep a neck attached whatever neck you like to use whether it's a straight or the curved you can leave it attached and just attach your mouthpiece when you get ready to play and do what you got to do. I love that about it. Also, um, it has space at the top, pockets. And not only does it have pockets, it has a handle. It comes with a, um, with a strap to hold it sideways, but it also has, which I'm going to be very careful because I got my stuff here, a pocket in the back. And it has straps where you can put it on your back, which is a definitely big plus. So, you know, for like six, 1600 I mean, 1600 bucks. I don't know what it costs now. I thought that was an excellent deal because what I really wanted was a P-Mariette. And those were about 2500 bucks. So, and then I got this second hand off of someone and I didn't even spend a 1000 They just looked out for me and, you know, I have a beautiful saxophone. So let's see what it sounds like. Bye. 
So maybe it's something you might want to look into. Uh, soprano that you, you may not have 2,500 bucks, but you can spend something less than 2,000. Might can work out for you. Uh, and it probably sounds a little better than mine because this one has been tampered with. So um, anyway, check out Chateau Soprano Saxophones. So this is Daryl Merle. Like, share, subscribe, click the bell for notifications. I'll definitely be doing a lot of saxophone lessons, saxophone related things, reviewing musical instruments, period. I'm a musician. I love music. I do other things besides play sax, but sax is my main thing. So um, stay tuned to my channel. Peace.